Hey, what's up guys? Welcome back to another episode of my final season of The Walking Dead uh, playthrough by Telltale Games. I hope you guys are having a beautiful day, taking care of what you guys need to take care of, stay, staying positive, staying healthy. And as always, man, we're about to continue on with this episode. Uh, if you guys don't know what's going on, go ahead and watch my episode one. If you guys are uh, coming back, welcome back. And let's go find AJ. Come on. We, uh, we made it to this little, uh, I guess, refuge of little kids, man. I think this is pretty dope, but hold up, hold up, hold up, hold up. It looks like we can go through here, too. I want to make sure. Little motherfucker! Hey! Hey! Uh... About time you woke up, your little boy just bit me! He's lucky I didn't take a boot to his head. Nearly took a chunk out of me. God, hurts him fierce. I I'm so sorry. He acts out sometimes. He's been through a lot. Yeah, well, ain't we all? Don't see any of us sinking our teeth into either of you. Boy needs to learn some respect. Damn. Okay. I'm pretty sure we have to go upstairs, but I want to see what's over here. I mean, she just got bit by AJ, so. Oh, so it is over here. It's not even upstairs. Let's go. All right, well, they I saved us. You were... I'm okay. And you know what you are? What? Ticklish. <laughs> <laughs> but, Tickle day, Jay. Let's go. That girl out there says you I got an her. achievement for that. Is that true? can't be doing that, kiddo. These people helped us. Yeah, they helped us, I AJ. I didn't mean to. She snuck up on me. Still, no more bites. No more bites. Yeah, You're come on, dead. AJ. That's good. Who's Watch this? kid for you. My name is AJ. Excuse me. I watched AJ for you. Thanks. I appreciate it. No problem. Well, not no problem he was a bit of a handful but i got off light compared to what ruby went through aj doesn't like people coming up behind him don't ever do it loud and clear little man thankfully i was here to calm him down with my alluring music hey you was going off my boy i'm lewis clementine okay lewis what's up Oh, nice yeah. locks. Totally forgot. Marlon left your bag in here somewhere. Don't worry, I've got it. Make sure we have everything. Yeah, there you go. Hell yeah, wouldn't be Clementine without that hat. Um, double, um, does he know what that is? It's dirty. Clean it. Maybe later. Back you go. Where it belongs. Dude, that can't be a good idea. That thing's bigger than him. Is it actually loaded? Yes. I'll guarantee he's a better shot than you. Hey. You guys do your thing, I guess. He know what he doing, man. Well, there is one. But you're armed. Oh, my darling. Oh, my darling. Oh, my darling Clementine. You are lost and gone forever. Can you play something else? Dreadful sorry, Clementine. <laughs> he got jokes. What do you think, AJ? I don't know. It's loud. It is. Loud is bad. Not always. Come press this key. You you can Come on. Yeah, give it a try, this AJ. This one right here. Come on. Go ahead, AJ. Press it. You could play it softly too, AJ. Come on. 
Now press this one. And this one. <laughs> You're a natural. <laughs> this man, AJ. You seen Rosie? Nope. Oh, shit. Got a bit of a situation out there. Um, <clears throat> hate to ask you just coming to and all, but could really use a hand. You up for taking out a few deadheads? All right, I have to keep my hands on the keyboard. Come on. Get your ass in gear. Gameplay in this <sighs> one is crazy. Fine. Let's go, Lewis. Come on. AJ ready. I like that. Rosie! Where the hell is she? You give her her weapon back? Good. We're gonna need you to put it to use. We've got a hunting party out there trying to get back inside. Need our help to clear the way. Seems to be a few more than usual these last couple days. It's almost like something drew their attention. Something like, I don't know, an explosion or a car crash. Bye. What? Just saying. There's gotta be some explanation. I don't think we've met. I'm Clementine. Yeah, I know. Your kid won't stop talking about you. Uh, um. Okay, and what's Hello, your name? Clementine. I'm Violet. Nice to meet you. Violet. Okay. What he said. All right, boys and girls. They're starting to fill in. Come on. Be careful out there. Don't mind Ooh, Violet. Ooh, he she, got the uh, arrow. Grows on you. I promise. Oh, this? It's a chair leg. I call it Cheryl's. Cheryl's. I like Louis. I like the guy with the. I need you to watch my back. Call out from inside if you see anything. Cool? Okay. See you on the other side. Yeah, stay right here, AJ. Good call, Clem. What's his name? Monster. Yeah, we got it. Come on. I pressed it. Get off me. Nice one, Clementine. Could use a little more finesse, though. Watch and learn. Hey, over here. Follow me. How'd you guys get that up there? Laying around this area for these ass hats. They're all marked, so keep a lookout. Oh, we gonna get this one right here. Yup. Oh, I had to use that. Come on. Come on. You walking too slow. Take this rock to the hay. Come on, rock to the dome. Looks like they made it back in one piece. Come on, meet them halfway. Come on, 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 come on. What? Hold up, get off me. Oh my god. Are you kidding me? Looks like they made it back in one piece. I pressed E, man. Let's go. Come on. Round two. I gotta stop fiddling with this. Ooh. Come around. W. Get off of me. Get off of me. Ooh, Clem. Yo, over here. Nice timing. We're not going to be able to hold them off much longer. No kidding. Where'd all these walkers come from? We can talk when we're back inside the gates. Keep an eye out for stragglers. You 
know, you're not half bad, considering the circumstances and all. Thanks. Let's finish these guys off. We don't need them attracting more walkers back to the school. All right, where am I going? Making friends. Rosie! Had a bad experience with the dog wines. Well, Rosie here can help you get over it. She's as cuddly as they come. Oh, except when she's mauling walkers, that is. Yo, she put in work, though. What's up, Rosie? That walker came out of nowhere. All right, all right, fun's over. Let's get inside. Ah, fucking starving. You're not the only one. Oh, How'd my God. Here? How do you think it went? Be that dog is down. crazy. Safe stones nearly. I love it. I could barely find enough for tonight. We're gonna have to scout out further if we want food for the winter. We'll talk about it later. Bullshit. We should talk about this right now. I said later, damn it. Still standing, I see. Come on, man. What you think? I'd call that a B plus performance there, Vi. You've done better. Fuck off. B minus then. Now, Clem here, that was a solid A. A plus even. Don't be jealous, Vi. Be better. Um, you kicked ass, Violet. A plus. I know. You're both delusional. Yeah, we have to get everybody on our side, man. Lewis is already cool with us. Let's try to keep this drama free. Even though she already came at me sideways. Like what? I seen you smiling at me when and looking at me when when I first came. Now you want to act different now that I'm up close. Come on, bro. They're pretty good with the monsters. Come on, y'all. Food's good. <sighs> AJ. Oh. Oh, shit. <laughs> yeah, you can't really walk up behind him. He's got a thing about that. Mm -hmm. Ooh. A painful thing. <laughs> you can't go around punching people into you know, expect them to eat at the same table. I'll talk to him. Hey. Hey. What are you looking at? What's that bird doing? That's gross. He should stop. The same thing we're doing. Surviving. But we don't eat monsters. Yeah, but if we could, we probably would. I wouldn't. Whatever you say. I wouldn't. Gross. I didn't mean to hit him. I didn't know that it was Marvin. Marlin. Right. AJ, okay, his name I'm is Marlin. Sure forgive you, but we should go talk to them. But but I don't think they like me. I can just tell. They don't. They don't know you, AJ. I'll bet when they do, they'll like you just as much as I do. I don't know. Marlin was really mad. And that girl I bit, she yelled at me. They're really scary. <sighs> AJ, listen. We haven't eaten for days. The car is gone. All that's outside these walls are walkers. Do you really want to go back out there? No. <sighs> so we should apologize to Marlin. Right and, now? And the other girl, too. We can work up to it. Let's talk to the other kids first. 
All right, help AJ make friends. Okay, cool. He said we could. She said we could work up to it. Come over here, AJ. Mitch and Willie. Hey. Hey, you're new. I am. I'm carving a weapon. Uh, yeah, I can see that. You're good at that. You like that, huh, little dude? Want to see something cool? I want to see. Yeah. <laughs> Pretty rad, huh? That's how you fuck up some monsters. Fuck up monsters, yeah. <laughs> 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 this guy AJ dude said fuck. Wait, can I not talk to them anymore? Okay, nah. Let's come over here. Mm, yes. Hey guys. Clem, AJ, this is Omar. Eh, excuse me. Chef Omar. Hello, and no, it's not ready yet. Omar, Omar, okay. Omar's I gotta remember all these names. The slightest flavor out of place, and he's grumpy for a week. You can eat, or you can eat right. All it'll cost you is a little patience. I'll let you guys know when we're done. Appreciate it, appreciate it. Okay, let's talk to this guy first. Omar? I sim. Hello? I sim, I sim. Hello. Oh, hey. It's you two. Clementine, right? Yep. A sim, right? A what sim. are you writing? What happened today? I chronicle everything. Hmm. Like a diary? I try That's to smart. more like a history book. Those Ooh, I like that. that. You seemed really mad at Marlin back there. He keeps pulling back the safe zone. We have fewer and fewer places to hunt. Which means we're gonna have fewer and fewer things to eat. The new girl went and helped the hun hunting party come back. She. Hey, zip it! That is not yours to read, kid. Give it back. Yeah, AJ, give that back. It's just sitting there. So? AJ, give it back to him. Okay. Thank you. This thing is the only place I get any real privacy around here. I gotta preserve what I can, you know? I gotta finish this before dinner. Not to be, like, rude, but, you know, bye. <laughs> Later, dude. Later, Asim. Let's go talk to this girl before we talk to Marlene. Just because this is the first incident that happened. Come on, AJ, don't be scared. You good. There's that girl up in. Yeah, wanna talk to her? You mean... Say I'm sorry. Yes. She's scary and always seems so mad. You can do it. You just gotta... Tell her why you did it. Because of my... thing? Yep. It's nothing to be ashamed of. Just be honest. There you go. There you go. Come on, AJ, you got it. We right here. Yes. I'm sorry I bit you sometimes. When I get scared, I do that, but I don't mean to. I just I just get scared and I'm sorry and I hope your finger is okay. There you go. I think it's alright. We can all get a little crazy when we get scared. Thank you for your honesty and your apology. I did it! You sure did. There you go, AJ. Come on. Look at Clementine being a good mother. Alright, come on over here. We're gonna talk to the head honcho, Marlin. Marlin and friend. Alright. I'm not ready. Not yet. Okay. Let's talk to someone else. Who who else is there? Okay, we got him, we got them, we got them. Maybe over here. Let me go ahead and run, man. Okay, yeah, these people over here. 
Hey guys. I have to apologize too. Knock it off, Ten. Heard you guys didn't have the best introduction. It wasn't my fault. I really am sorry. Really. I'm sorry too. What is this? Our graveyard. Can you guys still do that? Kinda, sorta. So, who's buried here? Nobody really. This is where we buried Ten Sisters' belongings. Minnie and Sophie. Twins. Lost them. Both about a year ago. Paying respects. Should we do that too? Maybe? Yeah, I think that'd be a very nice thing to do, AJ. Come on. Thank you. <laughs> ah, there you go. Clem? Yeah? I'm ready. Alright, let's go. Let's go, AJ. I like okay. that. Like before, I'm gonna be right here. That scary ass dog there, though, too. Clementine, right? I'm Brody. He's a Burly. sweet little fella. Figured there ain't a lot of room for sweetness still out there. I'm the lucky one. He's just naturally good. Naturally good? That's rare stuff. I'm really sorry I hit you. Can we please stay here and eat dinner and not go out into the forest and get killed by monsters? Well, don't sweat it, buddy. You can make it up to me by teaching me your technique. You, a regular heavyweight. Hey, Clem! AJ! Yeah, you should have seen his dad. <laughs> Alvin was definitely a heavyweight. After all. Heavyweight. R.P. Alvin. Ladies and gentlemen, dinner is served. <sighs> Thanks. Wow, can't remember the last time we had a hot meal. Mmm, this is really good. Mm. <laughs> oh, come on. <laughs> Where are your manners, AJ? Good night. Good night. Clem. I'm sorry, buddy. I'm sure they shared as much as they could. AJ, heads up. I'm full, kiddo. You can have the rest. Are you sure? You bet. <sighs> I'm all done. Mm-hmm. Me too. Now what? I'll tell you what. Time for something very important. Oh, God. Good night. Violet, it's time. What's the game tonight, Lou? War. The oldest game around. A game played by man and beast War. alike. The only game there is. I don't know the game. The only card game I've played had less people. Don't worry. You'll pick it up as we go. It's easy. Everyone gets a stack of cards. Everyone flips one over. Highest card wins. And the winner gets to ask Clem a question. What? I want to get to know you. We all do. And what if fair I enough. win? Then you get to ask us one. It's only fair. Oh, wait. What about AJ? What about him? <laughs> Looks like he's made a friend. Come on. That's what he used to you take your eyes off it for one card game. But you both could use a break from each other. AJ yeah, liked drawing. Maybe. This is his first time around anyone his own age. 
Sometimes he acts more like an adult than a kid. It's nice to see him act like a little boy again. Nice. If you would. Way to go, me. So, about AJ. Where are AJ's parents? Mm. You two don't really look related, so... What happened there? They're dead. They were nice people. For the most part. It makes sense. He's a nice kid. <sighs> For the most part. Hey, That's me, I baby. Win. That's me, hey, baby. You do. So, what do you want to know? Dang. Worst injury you ever saw. I uh, saw a walker get hit in the head so hard both his eyeballs flew out. Pretty cool. I saw someone have their intestines pulled all the way out. Like, all the way. It goes on for a while. We got a lot of guts. I saw this guy get his face beaten in with a crowbar. Badly. There wasn't even any skin left. Ouch. Mm, he deserved it. Booyah! Come on, spit it out. So, uh, ever, uh, ever have a boyfriend? What? Oh my god. This guy, but yeah. It like... happens. Perfectly valid question. You can ask me if I've ever had a girlfriend. I haven't, by the way. Oh, I'm sure she's real surprised about that one. I met a boy one time. And? And we were friends. Just friends. Nothing else? Gay. Nothing at all? She did have feelings for him. I don't know what you'd call them. She did, for sure. Sort of feelings for him. Not as much as Gabe had for her. Love, but something. Ah, I win. So, Clem, you can't have been alone this entire time. Who used to take care of you? Family? Anyone? The first person who taught me about survival was Lee. <laughs> What'd he teach you? Lots of stuff. Most important thing? Hmm. I'ma stay quiet. Too many things, bro. Sensitive subject. Got it. I win again. You do indeed. <laughs> Ask away. Marlin's haircut? Why am I gonna say What's that? Whatever. What's up with your haircut, Marlin? Oh boy. Uh, what do you mean? She means it looks like a dead cat. Probably smells like one too. Uh, I look cool. <laughs> Whatever you say. I say I look cool. <laughs> How long is this gonna go on for? Victory Violet. Here's something I love to ask when I'm in groups. Mm. Out of the four of us, who do you think is gonna die first? Ooh. That is fucked up. <laughs> oh, I know. Ooh. Any one of you, but certainly not me. So sure. Made it this far. So have we. Why'd you ask then? You don't think I'm gonna say myself? I like, am what? the greatest card player of all time. Just ask your damn question. Ever? Actually, never mind. What? Ask it. It's not a fun question. Ask. Ever had to kill someone you loved? Hmm. Lewis. Hey, she wanted me to ask. Lee. His name was Lee. It was the same day I found out my parents were dead. That sounds like a rough day. Yeah, worst day of my life. I 
think I'm done playing for tonight. Yeah, it's probably for the best. You wanted me to ask. Let's go, AJ. Uh, good night. Night, AJ. I wonder what happened to that kid. <sighs> long day, huh? Yep, real long. I hope you know Lewis didn't mean any harm there. He's just the world's biggest dumbass. Yeah, he's my best friend, so I can legally call him that. You guys relax. Get some sleep. Feel human for a night. In the morning, come find me. We can talk about making this long term. We can stay? We can talk about it. I like that. I like that. I mean, why not? It's it's gone good so far. If anything were to happen, I mean, we know we could survive on our on our own. So, hell yeah, we'll talk to you, Marlin. No, I think everybody cool. I think those are just natural things to ask, especially in apocalypse like this. These guys are all like teenagers, so I mean, like, I'm trying to be as as honest with them as I can. That looks like a really safe window. It does. Good. This box has so many colors. <laughs> I had told him to look out for windows. That's why he said that. Well, must have been an artist living in here. What's an artist? It's like a person who colors a lot, draws, does pictures. You mean like 10? Yeah, like 10. Huh. I like to do pictures too. Oh, shit. I, I didn't know Marlon set you up in this room. I just wanted to grab something from the closet. Where the hell is it? Oh. What? That's what I was looking for. It belonged to Sophie. Uh, Ten sister. He was asking for more art supplies and stuff, so I was going to. Oh, sorry. We didn't know. No, no. It's it's fine. Don't don't worry about it. Honestly, it's just been sitting here for the past year and no one's touched it. If AJ wants to play with it, it's it's fine. Hmm. You should probably give the box back. It doesn't belong to us. We'll get you some crayons, Thanks, AJ. Buddy. It's just that Ten wanted it since it was his sister's and all. It's okay. You can finish your drawing, though. I don't mind. Huh. I see you're, um, settling in. Yeah, is that okay? Sure. I guess. I always liked this room. Sophie had like paintings and shit on the walls. Lots of color. And Minerva. She was really musical. Not like Lewis, though. She had actual talent. <laughs> she had the most amazing voice. Real bluesy. Marlon always joked that he would scavenge a guitar and the two of them would tour the country. That was a long time ago. After they... Afterwards, Brody and Ten took down all the paintings, and that was the end of it. I shouldn't have even brought it up. It's not a good memory. Guess I just lost my train of thought. Oh, they sound like they were great friends. Yeah, Sophie was a good friend. And Minnie... Uh, we were close. Me and her. What exactly happened to them? Sophie and Minerva. They went scavenging with Marlon and Brody out past the safe zone. Didn't make it back. It happens. Honestly, That's... I just miss having someone around to talk to. There's just so many dudes. This place can get a little too bro-town for my liking sometimes. 
And I'm not exactly like a people person, you know? I know I sometimes have a habit, have a habit of being a little bit too harsh. You come off all right. I thought you were pretty cool. Um, thanks, I guess. You were pretty cool too, up there against those walkers. Hey, Clem, I'm an artist now. Not bad, kiddo. I should be getting back. Thanks again for the box. You're pretty cool, AJ. See ya. Yeah, see ya. <sighs> okay, Alvin Jr. Okay, Time okay. For bed. Okay. I like Violet. Here. I don't think she's as tough and strong as she uh for me first portrayed herself to be. For the be. wall to make our home look nice. That's a good idea, AJ. Can I put it anywhere else? Okay, no, right here. How about here? Ooh, I like uh, that. AJ. Hey there, what are you doing? This is where I'm gonna sleep. <laughs> what? No, it's not. It's safe under here. No one can get me. Well, it's safe out here too. Did you see the size of this place? It's huge and there are plenty of brick walls to keep us safe. What about the door? What if someone comes in? What if they try to hurt us? What if they steal our stuff? I'll keep watch. I'll sleep with one eye open if I have to. You can't sleep like that. I tried. If I stay here, <laughs> no one can find me. And I can keep guard and watch over you. I can protect us. <sighs> hey, what's gotten into you? Please, Clem. It's not so bad down here. I'll be okay. I promise. Man, damn. AJ, listen to me. It's gonna be okay. Please just give the bed a chance. It's soft and warm. I think you'll really like it. Yeah, come on, AJ. I don't want you sleeping on the floor, bro. You're gonna get cold. It's hard. Like, come on. I know it's been tough, but get used to a bed, man. There this you go. bed is really soft. There you go. Told you so. It's really, really soft. Good night, AJ. There you go, AJ. Imagine if I would have left him under the bed. Huh? Like, nah. Mm -hmm. This place is nice. I'm glad we found it. Me too. Okay. I like it too. I was going to say before, that's probably why Marlon doesn't want to go past the safe zone. Because of what happened to um, He's gonna let us Sophia, stay, right? I think Sophie, I guess and we're gonna the sister. Find out. Let's find his office. I know where it is. I'll show you. How you know where his office is at, bro? Up here. Come on, Clem, this way. Hey, AJ, wait up. This guy energized off that good meal, that good sleep. Tintu. Hey, Clem. Thanks for the pencils. I missed having colors. Sure thing. Who are these guys? They're firefighters. That one's a policeman. She's gonna save the day. But what are they? They... These were the people who protected us. Where are they? I've never seen one before. They all died a long time ago, trying to save everyone. Oh, they were weak. What? 
But no, they were brave, strong. Now give it to me and... No, he's mine now. Hey, give it back. No. You don't even know what they are. Okay, okay, that's enough, you two. It's not yours anymore. What do you mean? It's mine. No, it's not. Ugh, fine. Thanks. Yeah, like, AJ, you those are not your is. toys, bro. Come on, what you doing know. saying that's mine? He should be around. I can go find him. That'd be nice. Thanks, Ten. Yo, bro, you need to chill out, AJ. Look. Hey, what'd you find? It's a picture of Marlon and Lewis. They're so little. Wow, they've known each other a long time, huh? Marlon? Stay back. Oh my god. Oh my god. Whoa, what the hell's going on? Hey, 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 it's okay, bro. Shh. You said dogs brought back bad memories. I'm sorry. I didn't realize you were so scared of them. But I swear, Rosie's not as frightening as she seems. I don't know, bro. Sit, girl. See? She's harmless. She just needs to get to know you is all. Here. I'll show you. Do you trust me? Oh my god. Rosie. Shh. Sorry. I promise she's not gonna bite. <sighs> Come on, okay. let's do it. I guess. We gotta get over this fear. This is get an down ally down. at the end of the day. Better get your scent. It's okay. She's not gonna hurt you. There you go. Now whistle and tell her to lie down. Lie down, Rosie. Ooh, let's go. There you go, Rosie. You sit your ass down. So cool. See? Not so hard. Yeah, that was pretty cool. And now Rosie will recognize you. She's really well trained. She was the headmaster's dog back when this place was still functional. But when the world went to shit, we bailed. All the other adults did. Left us behind to fend for ourselves. Wow, what a dick. <laughs> Understatement of the century. Now it's just us kids left. And I'd like it if you and AJ were a part of that. Both of you are plenty capable, and we need that. Here. This is the current state of our plan for gathering food. We are starting to run short. It's getting harder and harder to feed everyone in this school. Let me see something. Let me see. Look at hunting What's area. The trap area. Hunting That's where we we're fighting. Lewis. That's where we we're fighting. Lewis built some traps out there to catch game. He and Sam are set to go check them today. That's where we we're fighting at. What's out here? Oh, that's where we fish. Uh, I got a shack for storage right here, right along the river. It's secure mostly. You get the occasional walker or two come by. Vine Brody should be heading out there in a bit. I like this. I like this. That's the only road that leads in and out of Erickson. If you go off it, you'll eventually end up in the valley. We used to have signs that led people to the school, but I took them down. I wanted this place to be hard to find. I didn't realize how much forest surrounds this place. It's how we've kept ourselves from unwanted attention for so long. Well, for the most part. Greenhouse. Okay, let's look at the greenhouse the greenhouse. First. Oh, yeah. Well, don't get too excited about that one. We used to maintain it real well. I had plenty of vegetables growing. But it became overgrown. Upkeep was impossible. Yeah, we, uh, we keep away from that now. 
That's the train station. There was a whole stash of food under the floorboards. Oh, where you crashed your car? Pretty sure that place a lost cause. There's a hell of a lot of smoke coming from it when we found you two. Walkers flooded in there after all the noise you made. One more thing. See these red lines? Yeah. So everything inside is the safe zone. It's been getting smaller over the years, and food's become more scarce. So, why not go outside it? <laughs> we can't. Whenever why? Goes outside the safe zone, bad shit happens. People die or disappear. I just... <clears throat> I could really use the help, Clementine. We're taking care of these kids. It's not easy. I'm worried that if I don't figure something out, if... If I don't fix our food situation, I can't lose anyone else. We've already lost so much. Friends, siblings, I... We're not gonna let that happen. I promise. <sighs> Thanks, Clementine. I appreciate that. I really do. Everyone's counting on me to step up. Be the leader they need me to be. I really want to be that for them. With the American flag you behind us. Just two more mouths to feed. Maybe you can help me feed the rest. So what do you need from us? Lewis and Asim are heading to the hunting grounds, looking for rabbits. Well, Asim will, anyway. Lewis, I uh, just hope he shows up, if I'm really being honest. Violet and Brody are going up river to do some spear fishing. And hopefully, those two get along long enough to get some work done. Both teams could use some extra hands. Damn. Damn, this is hard. This is a hard decision. Let's go, Vibe. We're gonna go fishing. Okay. Take this. I don't want you getting lost. Thanks. We need all hands on deck if we're gonna find any more food. Just remember to stay in the safe zone. We need you to come back home in one piece. So that means we can stay? What? Do you think I was gonna throw you out? Maybe. Well, as long as we got enough to eat, you're both welcome here. Go get him, AJ. All right, let's get going. Sounds good. Sounds like a plan. Let's go, Marlin. See you around. Are we going fishing, man? We going fishing. How much more we have left on this episode one? You know, I've been thinking. I wish we could all go on a road trip together. Road trip? Why bother? It's not like there's anything worth seeing anymore. Oh, come on. I'm sure there's plenty of stuff to see. Maybe Clem could show us around. You're able to get a car working, and you know how to drive? Barely. Come on, Vi. I've never driven in my life, but I'd love to learn. Are you sure you trust my driving? I promise I don't usually crash. <laughs> oh, right. On second thought. Yeah, I think Clem just totaled the last working car in the world. <laughs> so much free road trip. Are we going to the car? No, bud. It's broken. Good. I'm sick of the car. I wish this old rust bucket was still working. We could just jump in and start driving. We could take turns sitting in the back. It'd be like driving one of those cars with the top that goes down. And we'd run out of gas eventually. But still, it's fun to imagine, isn't it? <laughs> Where would you go, Clem? If you could drive anywhere you wanted. If gas wasn't an issue. Or a busted carburetor, or flat tires, or the transmission. Buzzkill. I'd drive down to the coastline. Maybe park on the beach and go swimming. That'd be an absolute dream. You could spend every day in the sun. And die of skin cancer. Fun. We're all gonna die. I'll take skin cancer over turning into a walker any day. 
I've lived here my That's a fact, life. though. Heck, I'd say I know every inch of these woods. I'd kind of like to unknow it. No use dreaming of what could be. We've got shit to do. Yeah, I guess we should get to work on those fish. Brody's a dreamer. We got spears inside the shack. Come on. You go ahead. I'll stay out here. Where are those spears? Hey, about by. I'm sorry she's being a little mean. It's my fault. What do you mean? I was there when those walkers killed Sophie and Minnie. They were really close with Vi, and I think she blames me for what happened to them. I mean, how do you even apologize for something that fucked up? You should talk to her about it. I'm sure she'll listen. <laughs> yeah, right. I tried. I have. It just never seems like the right time. We all used to be friends. <sighs> Guess I just kind of missed that. But when you showed up, I, I don't know. I just haven't seen her warm up to someone in a long time. Hmm. So what, you want me to mend y'all y'all relationship? I, mean, I hate to ask this of you, but do you think you could talk to her? For you? See how she feels about me? It's just been eating me up inside. Nah. I don't think I should get involved. It sounds like you two should just talk it out yourselves. That's a fact. There oh, you go, Clementine. Right. Yeah, you're right. Sorry, it was stupid of me to ask. I'm gonna go check our fish traps downstream. Hey, what the hell is taking you two so long? See? I'll take I mean, this to buy. There should be some extras lying around. We are kind of taking, taking long. What she say? There's what? Find a spear. Okay. Let me talk to AJ. Hey, what you looking at? V plus M. Violet and Minerva. What does that mean? Sometimes you can make art out of words. They made their names art. Just some old gardening supplies. That'd be good though for the greenhouse. Or am I tripping? All right, extra spears. Where would they have these extra spears? Oh, this is cool. Cat school. Yeah, we we putting this in our room. Hold up, we're not done in here yet. Cool. Ready to get some fish? Yeah. Okay, let's go. I'm glad I found that collectible. Ooh. These are big ass fish. <laughs> Can I you have to, join you? You have sure. to get behind the fish. Hey, check out these guys over here. They're swimming against the current. Guess I don't realize it makes them easier targets. I want to try. Take a spear. Go nuts. I'm about Go to catch one. They're not running. Hold up, hold up. Too fast. That one's coming way too fast. Any luck? I got something. Good enough for me. Mm, let's go. Now, we're going to keep going. Hey, sorry if I was weird last night about the whole room thing. Seeing someone else in there, uh, it was harder than I expected. You'd think I'd be less sentimental by now. <laughs> Don't sweat it. I'm glad we got to know each other. Yeah, I guess I am too. 
All right, here we go. Not yet, not yet. Next one passes by, I'm getting it. trip together god she's so mm, you act like you hate her damn oh my god why are these guys going so fast now oh yeah no no i'm gonna catch one now Think they could get by me? Come on. Looks like they wisened up. Maybe Brody had better luck with the traps. I got one. Clem, I got one. <laughs> Good job. Put in, yeah, put in the bucket, AJ. I don't know what the problem is between us with Brody. I don't know why it's like this. Why is it so weird? I can never relax around her. It just keeps getting worse. Because you blame her for what happened with the twins. Well, that's what I used to think. I just keep thinking that things might have ended differently if I was there. Maybe I could have protected Soph. And Minnie. She wants to talk about it, you know. I just, I feel guilty about the whole thing. Why? I was supposed to be out with the twins that day. I wanted to work in the greenhouse, so I asked Brody to cover for me. But then... I didn't even get to say goodbye. I... I wanted to talk to Brody. To tell her I didn't blame her for what happened, but every time I tried, I was reminded of who we lost. It was easier to just not talk about it. We should get going. You guys catch any fish? We caught some, but not a lot. I didn't get anything. We should catch up with Lewis and Asim. See if they had any better luck. The Grand Canyon. What? That's where I'd go. If we took a road trip, start driving until we hit the Grand Canyon. Yeah. That would be cool. There you go. I thought you weren't gonna... Thank you. It's just how it worked out. Hey, you slow folks coming? Yeah, we're right behind you. It's just how it worked out. She opened up to me, so you know what? I was like, you know what? I'm gonna just tell her how I feel about it. Try to mend that relationship. Why not? Where are those guys? Practicing making out with a toothless walker. Gross. I know. Poor walker. <laughs> <laughs> what the hell? Well, what? This isn't normal? Someone sabotaged this. This isn't good. A Sam? Lewis! Spread out. See if we can find them. Just watch out for out? monsters. Oh my god. Alright, here we go. Huh. Empty. Huh. Is this a Bible page? Clem, found something. Monster. Guys, over here! 
Well, we didn't kill this one. We wouldn't have left it hanging in our trap. What the hell? Found this too. Do any of the kids smoke? Nope. Nothing to smoke. Who is this unlucky fella? Where have you been? Checking nearby traps. The ones that were sprung were all empty. All the rest are broken. Someone robbed us? Oh, great. And now we're gonna starve. <sighs> Fuck. That's... Fuck. Fuck. It's Yo, just... keep it. Fuck, it's okay. It's... Breathe, Brody. Come on. Come on, come on, come on. You're gonna be fine. It's just a panic attack. Take a second. Breathe in deep. And hold it. Just shut the fuck up, okay? Excuse me? I, I have to tell Marlon about this. Um, we still need food. You know, to live. We definitely don't have enough here. You guys figure it out. I don't like this girl, bro. Now you just gonna quit? You gonna have I'll a panic attack about school. not having food and then quit? Like, what? So what do we do? Eat rocks? You can't eat rocks. I'm aware. Will Marlon kick us out if we don't find food? Well, let's not find out. Where else could we look? <sighs> Let me think. The train station. Yeah, that's the yeah, that's the only thing. Have to. The train station. It's not too far from here. Maybe, but it's outside the safe zone. There was food in there when AJ and I passed through. It's worth a look. You sure there was food? Positive. Yeah, some of it was destroyed in the explosion, but there has to be something left. There was so much there. Or we could starve. If I'm gonna have any two with me, it's these two. So Let's go. Yeah. Hell yeah. But that doesn't change the fact that somebody's sabotaging our shit. There's somebody out there. Some bandits. <laughs> This episode is getting long, guys. There. That's where the food is. A lot more walkers than last time, though. We're gonna die. It's either die here or die from hunger. Take your pick. Clem, maybe you should scope things out. You know the place better. Let me get a closer look. Can't be too careful. to get in there somehow. Maybe there's another way in. Could climb up there, but I don't know how that would get us inside. We barely got out of here. It was close. It sounds scary. There's a reason. That bell might be able to get the walkers' attention. They do like to follow sound. You look like you've got an idea. The noise from that bell could draw a lot of walkers. If one of us climbs up there and starts ringing it, Lewis, I vote Lewis. Uh, hold on. I'd like to make an alternate suggestion. Come on, Lou. You're loud, dramatic, a little annoying. You're basically a walking distraction. I think you mean charming and theatrical. Okay, yeah, you got charming. this, bro. Come on, Lewis. Talents in action. I can't say no to a face like that. I'll go with you. This guy, he's trying to speak game. Fine, I'll do it. But if I die, I'm making sure Walker Lewis eats both of you first. I'll distract them until I see you guys reach safe cover. Then, I'll try to redirect the smelly patrol to give you guys a chance to sprint inside the building. When we get into position, I'll signal you. Then you can do your thing. Good luck! There you go, Lewis. Hey, ugly! No, not you. Not you either. Sam. Fine. Maybe this one's coming. I couldn't do anything about that one. Oh my god, of course there's one right here. Come on then. Right. 
Look at this guy. Okay, we in, we in, we in. Come on, come on, come on. Good job, AJ. So far, What is he waiting for? Come on, come on. We gotta hide. Hold up. We gotta hide. Hold up. Just give him a second. He may not have a second. Oh my goodness, there you go, Lewis. I'll watch the door for lockers. Okay, AJ and I will sneak in, grab the food, and get out. Sounds good. Let's make it quick. We're gonna make it out of here alive. This guy's not dead. I knew it. It should have given me the option to kill. I knew that that walker wasn't dead. Oh my god. Yeah, let's hop up in here. We, we already know what's in here. Come on, come on. Let's make moves, AJ. Yes, these will be perfect. Flint, look. Try it out. See if it works. Gonna need your help on this one, kiddo. You still got your gun? Just in case. Just in case. All right, AJ. Let's make this smooth, please. Good job, AJ. Is there more? Keep it coming. Come on, come on, come on. But make moves fast, though. Come on. There's some on the table, too, Clem. Stand. Slowly. Oh, my Don't yell. God. Don't try anything. I won't hurt you. I don't have to. What do you want? I just want food. Same reason you're here. You and your friends made a lot of noise out there. It wasn't hard to follow. You live close by? You knew about this place already and organized some effort to get inside. I'm not telling I'm I'm not saying so anything. You probably also knew the stash was there. Doesn't matter. It wasn't really a question. More like confirmation. to be out on your own. You got a group. Count you plus the two outside, I'm thinking maybe more. You got a camp in these here woods? I'm not saying anything to this guy. <laughs> well, sometimes no answer is good as anything. Now, I'm gonna fill this pack real slow. We worked hard to get this stuff.
Well, hey there, Squirt. Playing hide and seek, are we? Now that's impolite. Oh my god. Don't steal from us. I'm not stealing. This isn't yours. I can kill you, you know. Come on, kid. I'm faster than you. Listen up, Squirt. You're gonna quit pointing that gun at me and let me go my Mary. You understand? I'm just gonna take a oh little bit, then I'm leaving. Like it never happened. AJ, get down! Hell yeah! Right? You piece of shit! Like what? Hell no, you ain't taking from us. And you what took our fuck? traps. Come Just on, hurry up. up. Hurry up. Hurry up. We made moves. Let's go. We made moves. Now. now, like right now. Hand on the keyboard. Hand on the keyboard. Make moves, Lewis. Where's AJ? What Just move. I'll tell you on the way. His group is gonna come out for vengeance, I already know. He was with the group for sure. At least one or two other people. Oh my god. Oh my goodness. You are not listening to me, Marlon. Listen to me. I am telling you, the place was ransacked. It's fine. We'll deal with it. Took y'all a while. How poor are they that have not patience? A Sam! Bitch! Check it out! Food! Hell like yeah. A lot of food. Observant as ever, Mitch. I can't believe this. Look at it. You're our savior, Clem. Like, seriously, it's a lot. Lewis and Violet helped too. Neither of them ever brought back this much before. Neither have you. Where did you find all this? The old train station. Ma'am, you would Where know, Bonnie, if place? you didn't just ditch us. Station, that's outside the safe zone. We'd have even more, but we ran into the creep that fucked up our rabbit traps. Creep? What creep? Clem saw him smoking those nasty-ass Bible cigarettes. He had weird, different colored eyes. Did he follow you? And nope. He's I done. shoved him into a pack of walkers. They took a chunk out of him. It was awesome. Look, I don't know if he got out of there, but if he did, he won't make it for long. You attacked him? What the fuck? If he survived, you know he's coming back for revenge. What the hell were you thinking? I'm done with Bonnie. This is fucked. How could you be so stupid? Wanna try stepping back, Brody? I'd recommend it. I'd recommend you getting your head out of your ass before we're all dead. I don't care. Brody's annoying. I just can't. I won't. Just not again. Fuck! What the hell's going on here? She took them outside the safe zone. They saw someone. You know what that means. Enough. Just means there's a hungry guy out there looking for food. It's happened before. You are overreacting. You can't be serious. Come on, let's go somewhere and talk about this. Ooh. If anything happens, I'm holding you responsible. Whatever, bro Brody. Walk away like you always do. Clem. Whatever, Brody. I know I asked you for help. You did. You did. But. Shit. God. Nothing's easy. It was risky, but it was worth it. Like you said, we can't lose another kid. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, I did say that. <laughs> well, at least we're eating tonight. For the next few, I'd wager. Um, I'll go talk to Brody. 
Thanks for the haul, Clint. You guys should go enjoy it. You should go hit the weights, bro. She just knocked you on her on your ass with one push. Don't sweat it, Clem. Ever since we lost Sophie and Minnie, Birdie's been freaked out by anything that happens past the safe zone. She'll be all right eventually. Still, we should make sure this is a one-time thing. We can take Rosie out in the morning, see if she catches a scent. You know, just in case. I'm gonna go clean up. I think I'll go too. See you later. They definitely coming back with a group. Don't worry about them. They're just sad. Sad? Why? My sisters died around this time last year. I think it's starting to get to people. Doesn't it get to you? Not really. Dying's not scary. I mean, it's sad, but not scary. Let's just hear him talk. I try not to focus on them being gone. I like picturing where they'd be now, instead. Sophie was awesome at making stuff. She'd build a place big enough for all of us to live. And paint it too. And Minnie be playing whatever new song she wrote. <laughs> I guess that's a AJ loves it. I know I have something waiting on the other side. Someplace safe and happy. All of us together. I wish I had more colors. Who are those guys? The walkers who killed them. You want them there too? They weren't always walkers. Wherever this place is... This little nigga 10 it. is profound. Sometimes I draw the walkers the way they probably looked. Sometimes I draw Minnie and Sophie the way they probably left them. But sometimes Ooh. I draw this too. Can can I be there? Sure. You want to be there too? I promise I'll draw you well. Sure, why not? These are people in the afterlife, though. Oh, I almost forgot. Here you go. It's yours. It's ours. Oh my god, ten. It's getting late. Yeah, you guys should get some sleep. Aren't you coming? Not yet. I want to finish this first. Good night. See you tomorrow. Completed Act 2. Okay, how many acts are there in one episode? Jesus. I'm going to start wrapping this up, guys, as soon as I get the next chance. Time for bed, little guy. Can I stay up? Nope. Two more minutes. Tell you what, you lay down, and then we'll see. You full from dinner? Yeah, it was good. Yeah, it was. I like it here. I got to kill fish. Violet looked like she was having a good time. It's nice, not driving everywhere or running away. But the ranch was nice, too, before the blood. This the isn't the ranch. ranch. Yeah, we need to know what happened there. Do you like it? I like it, now that I'm used to it. There's games, and the walls make it feel safe. It's good, for now. But places change, and so do people. It might not stay good. Don't worry. We're not leaving. There. You gotta stay up two minutes more. Time for sleep. I'll lay down when you blow out the light. All right. Give me a minute. 
all right and this is where we we where we are going to wrap up the video guys um a lot has happened i don't even know like why they're doing this episode so long it's already an hour and 20 and i already have another part on this but we're going to continue on with this episode in the next episode <laughs> so i hope you guys enjoyed it if you guys did go ahead and leave a like go ahead and share it to your family and friends would be very much appreciated and go ahead and hit that subscribe button down below guys i appreciate you guys watching have a good one take care of yourselves it's your boy c star and me clem and aj we'll catch you guys in part three peace